hi guys welcome back to my channel <laughs> thank you so much for clicking on this channel please do like subscribe and comment today i am doing a get to know me tag and i just thought it was about time you know before we continue with you know some more content but in any case, I'm doing a get to know me tag and this is an opportunity for me to tell you who I really am and why I say that I am actually kind of a big deal. <laughs> um, yeah, so please do grab yourself some coffee, get a cup of tea and please do join me because I have my cup of tea already here and um, I did take a couple of sips of it. But yeah, please do get yours and in the meantime, also click on that subscribe button I'll just give you a couple of seconds to do that. Welcome back. Now let's get right into it. And um, I'm going to tell you something. Usually when YouTubers do a get to know me tag, they ask people to ask them or their followers to ask them questions on their Instagram. I didn't do that purely because I have such anxiety about um, nobody ever replying to my questions if I do that. Um, I don't know. I just have this thing that I'm going to catch feelings because I just think that uh, my followers are not that engaging and they're probably not going to respond to my question. I don't know. Uh, that's just, you know, my insecurity. But uh, maybe they will maybe they won't maybe one day i'll have the guts to ask you all to ask me questions i don't know <laughs> but in any case i'm going to answer a couple of questions that i think are relevant and some things that i think that you should know about me number one what is my full name my full name is lishan kajas okay um that's my maiden name I well, I don't know if I should say maiden because I'm not married yet. So, okay, that's okay. My full name is Lishan Tahas. Where am I from? I am from Bentuk, Namibia. Although I was born in another town in Namibia called Ochiborongo, I spent most of my life in Bentuk. I did my schooling in Bentuk and I grew up in Bentuk. And um, I used to go back to my hometown for like holidays and stuff. I also did a couple of years of schooling there, but I'm currently living, residing, working in Bintuk. So I guess I'm a Bintuker. So yes, I'm from Bintuk, Namibia. And in case you don't know where Namibia is, Namibia is just on the south of this of um Namibia is in the south of the African continent. It is just a little above South Africa. Um, it is above South Africa and it's a small country. We have a population of about 2.5 million people. So yes, in the entire country, 2.5 million people in the entire country. One of the things I love about my country is our small population because when I see how, you know, the population is huge in other countries and you know people can't walk freely in the streets you always got to be bumping into people we don't have none of that in namibia and i really appreciate and love that about my country so yes um i'm from namibia how old am i is the next question <laughs> how old am i if you haven't seen my previous vlog, um, please do go back and watch it. Well, I don't really say my age, do I? But in any case, okay, so um, in my previous vlog, I celebrated my birthday on the 28th of June and I just turned 33 years old. So I am 33 years of age. I love it. I love this new age. I feel like it has made me or turned me into a brand new person. I feel brand new. I feel like I can take take on the world. And this is a feeling that I didn't have in my 20s. Um, not even at 28 did I have this feeling. So I'm a happy 33-year-old. I am a happy 33-year-old young lady. 
Um, next question. Why did I start this YouTube channel? I signed on to YouTube a couple of years ago, so I've had this channel for quite a long time. Um, but I just never posted on it. And because I'm a DJ, I used to post music and music videos and some of my gigs on it. But um, I've always wanted to have a channel where I vlog because why? I love sharing experiences. I love sharing things that I go through. I love sharing places I visit, food that I eat. Um, guys, I just love sharing. And I think sometimes I'm also an oversharer because if you follow me on Instagram, yo, I share. Even worse, if you follow, if you're in my contacts, in my WhatsApp contacts, I share. I overshare, um, and I know, I know, it's not good. Uh, but I'm still working on them. But in any case, the point of the matter is that I love sharing. I love sharing my experiences. I love sharing my thoughts. I love sharing my ideas. And I think YouTube is the perfect opportunity and the, the perfect platform um, to do just that. And so I think if anybody would like to get to know me, who I am, they think I think they should check out my YouTube channel and you know some of my vlogs and stuff. Um, but also another reason is that when I leave the earth, I would love to leave behind something that people can always watch and remember me by instead of just being wiped off of the earth and, you know, people don't have, uh, can't hear my voice anymore, especially in the future. If I do have uh, more kitties then or children, then I would love to leave this vlogs and all of these experiences behind for them, even if it's on the internet, so that they can get to know their mommy. If they miss me, you know, if friends and family miss me, they can always check out these videos and they'll feel like I'm right there, that like, I'm, like I didn't even die. So that is uh, the reason why I start. those are the reasons why I started this channel. Next question, what do I do for a living? Hmm. Now, if you know, um, now if you've seen the title of this video, I said I'm actually kind of a big deal. Um, I'm a DJ um, and I am the first female DJ in my country. I started DJing in 2010 uh 2011 2010 and when i started djing there were actually uh no female djs in my country and so i am a pioneer of female djing in my country i've done um a whole lot of things i've been an, a judge for the country's music awards for about five years i've been an ambassador for one of the biggest brands in our country, Ventug Lager, um, uh, Ventug Lager Nam Namibia Breweries, if you know it. Um, I've opened and managed and run a whole radio station. Um, there is a whole lot of accolades that I've achieved um, in my life at this very young age. So that's why I say I'm kind of a big deal. But what I do by profession is that I am a radio presenter. I work on radio. I work for the national broadcaster and I'm a radio DJ. If you've seen my previous video, I also mentioned that I do a radio show um, from 6 to 9 a.m. on a weekday morning. And I said that one day I'm going to do a video where I take you guys with me to work so you can see exactly what I do and how I execute my professional duties. Um, so yeah, I am a radio presenter by profession. That's my job. That's what I do. But I'm also a DJ. And by that, I am a pioneer of the female DJs in my country. Um, you can Google me. Yes, you can. <laughs> what are some of my interests? Well, I love content creating. I love sharing. Um, um, I love music. Music is everything um i love god um i love people i love going to places i love traveling i just love it all i just love it all so yeah those are just some of my interests you know uh content creating traveling 
uh, meeting new people um, uh, yo, there's a whole lot of interest but yeah I, I love sharing I love sharing uh, on the internet <laughs> um, do I have kids I have a daughter I am a, a single mommy um, she's 12 years old and she's not gonna be in my vlogs because she's at that age right now where she just wants to do her own thing I have a daughter she's 12 years old um, she's not gonna be in my vlogs most of the time or she's not gonna be in my vlogs mostly because she's at that age where she just wants to do her own thing and so I don't want to impose on her um, the things that I do but yeah I have a daughter and she's 12 that's all you need to know um, the next question is what is my religion I am a Christian born and brave yes I come from a Christian family I believe in God I believe that Jesus Christ is my Lord and Savior I am saved and I'm a Christian I love Jesus I pray to God and yeah I love God that's my religion that's what I believe in that's who I believe in what is the favorite thing about myself mm. <coughs> sorry <laughs> okay next question um favorite thing about myself i really love the fact that i am so determined if I decide to do something, I totally put my all in it. Um, I go ahead and do it no matter the obstacles. Um, I pray through the obstacles though. And also, um, just the fact that I hate giving up on things. I don't like giving up. Giving up makes me feel like a failure, makes me feel like a loser. So I don't like giving up. And at the end of the day, when I don't give up on something, I tend to find that the results are in my favor. So it's always a lesson for me to persevere and to keep on trying and to never give up and to keep on going. So those are the two things I really favorite things about myself um, is that I'm determined and I never give up. I push, I push until something happens. Um, am I currently dating or in a relationship? That's the next question. Well, well, well. <laughs> okay, guys, let me just be honest. I am single. I'm a single mommy. I'm not dating. I'm not seeing anybody. It's COVID. We're in lockdown in my country. Um, but I'm open to meeting new people because I have been single for a while. I just got to put it out there, but I'm currently not seeing or dating anybody. Um, what is my favorite color? Well, if you can tell by, you know, the background, my favorite color is white. I also love black. Um, I really have most of my clothes are black. Um, I really love black and I also totally love white. I think white goes with anything black goes with everything um so those are my two favorite colors yay and i think that is the end of it thank you so much for clicking on this video please do like subscribe and a comment will really be appreciated tell me if you like it also go follow me on instagram i'm gonna you know put my instagram handle in the description box below go follow me tell me if you like my videos and also please do subscribe until the next video take care of yourselves and adios